Hello and welcome back to ADSR Pro with me, Mike Smith. Uh, talking about Cubase 8 and all the new features that are packed uh, within it. Uh, this time we will have a look at the new VST bass amp. Uh, obviously I'm doing electronic music, however uh, it's still nice to use on basses. I do have a, a bass guitar that I sometimes play, which uh, this would be a great feature to add. So again, I've just got a little, uh, little bit of a production here. There's my bass, just a basic electronic bass. Let's just loop that section around and zoom in a little bit, see where we're at. So there you go, there's the bass. So on the insert now, we'll put the new VST bass amp. And here you go, nice looking. Let's start with the amplifiers. So here we've got a, a valve amp, Tweed, Green Tea, iTech, Paradise. Um, let's just play the bass, click on one. I think the Greyhound's the one. So when you click on it, it opens up this, this screen here. And you can see here you've got your bass, your frequency uh, of your low mid, I'm presuming, frequency sweep of your high mid and the treble, uh, input gain and output gain. So let's, uh, oh, let's loop that around. So the low mid. A low pass. Bit travel. Click on cabinets. Different cabinets to choose from. Eight by ten, four by ten, four by twelve, one by fifteen. There we go. That's nice. Post effects, different microphones. So okay. So you can select all the different mics. Mix between the two. I'm guessing that must be distance away from the cabinet. Configuration. Can you swap this around? Let's have it stereo. Master. Built in tuner. That's really nice. So let's have a listen to it in the mix. That's really, really nice. Uh, I like that a lot. Obviously, you've got pre effects here, so before you go into the amplifier, you've got all sorts you know, maybe a bit of compression, a um, bit of chorus, maybe phaser, flanger, enhancer, a bit of overdrive, lots and lots of options. Uh, let's maybe apply a little bit of compression. Solo it again, one sec. Loads of compression there. Maybe we try envelope filter. Thank you. 
So lots and lots to choose from, hundreds of different variations. Uh, really nice. Uh, I like the way um, Steinberg are going. They're obviously putting lots and lots and lots of time and effort and money into um, new features, um, making it you know one of the best doors available. And to be honest, I've used uh, Cubase for years, and I don't think I will ever change. Uh, I like everything about it. I like the way it flows. I like the fact that it's different from other doors. And yeah, the quality is second to none. So yeah, well done Steinberg. Um, brilliant. So that's just a quick, quick overview of the new VST bass amp in Steinberg QBS 8. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like what I do. So until next time, bye bye.